Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, we have seen a new arena on Sunday enter the contest, just this past Sunday. And I put up a score. I had no idea what the scores were going to look out. We just had a band wave, so scores tend to be a little lower after a band wave. But this arena also was fraught with some issues when it was first launched and had me thinking I was crazy. But let's find out how we did in this first arena. And I'll talk to you a little bit as we go and look and see who else uh, did well in this arena. All right. Scroll over because I still am not doing any of those. And all right, so we ranked 24, which got us the 1,500 five-star shards and that legendary crystal. Not bad. I do think it's worth it. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the leaderboard. And you can see I put up 11.3. Whether I do that again or not, I don't know. Coat hanger, congratulations. Uh, she put up, I don't know what score, to get rank two. Um, I'd be very curious to see what she put up. All right, let's see who else we may see. Now, this arena is only one day. And so people that have larger rosters definitely at an advantage. Because in that time, there's only so much I'll be able to put up. And honestly, I don't know if it's worth it. What I got is fine. Uh, Big Blue, congratulations. I already knew since uh, you said in the stream. But I don't think a lot of people want to grind this arena on Sunday. For me, I have mixed feelings. I love the upgrade here in the uh, rewards for this new arena. However, Sunday was normally my day to take a break. Not just Sunday, but Monday morning as well. Grinding in this one actually set me off a little bit in the other arenas. I grind all week, and this is the time I usually reset and get a fresh start Monday, you know, when the arenas start. I don't even know what the cutoffs are as far as, uh, you know, numerical. No idea. Um, but we'll see. We'll see how I go. I'm thinking this score, if I can find out what the cutoffs are for the 1500, that's really what I want to go for. I'm not really too interested unless I can put up a little bit more. I don't think I can compete with the larger rosters uh, without refreshing and boosting, which I'm not going to do. That's definitely not worth it. All right. And I'm guessing these uh, top 200 all got 1,500. And the Legendary Crystal, I'm not sure. You guys will have to tell me uh, what you got and how much you put up to get it. Because this is this new arena, I don't know. Now, here's what happened when it first started. Now, they told you you could use six stars, right? So I went and tried to use my six stars, and I couldn't use my six stars. So I was like, well, maybe I was mistaken. I thought I read that you could use six stars, but clearly I can't. So I just went ahead, used my five stars. And then I think a little bit later, I went to use uh, a synergy team and I accidentally used a six star. And I'm like, wait a minute. I thought I couldn't use them. And I'm like very confused at this point. I was like, was I in the wrong arena? I went back out, looked at the other arenas, 
And I'm like, okay, well, I guess I just didn't realize what was going on. It was really messing with my head. And uh, then I read, and sure enough, it was a bug. And I was like, oh, thank goodness. Thought my mind was already going. Uh, but in any case, that is going to do it. Very short video. I just wanted to show this arena. It's the only arena that I'll most likely be doing on Sunday, except if the T1 Alpha or the T4 Basic happens at the same time like it did. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Uh, if you haven't seen it already, I have done a face reveal. And so going forward, I will have my face, you've been warned, on videos. In videos like this, I'm not sure yet. I don't know if I want to do that uh, on a video like this. But for my crystal openings, there will be a face cam. And for videos where I'm talking about a champion, like my closer look or first look videos, there won't be a face cam in the beginning. But once all the gameplay is done and I give my summary on the champion and I just start talking about how I think this champion can be best used or, you know, my impressions, that one I'll turn the face cam on uh, towards the end of the video. So that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. And you all have a blessed day.